In this video, I want to do a few examples on integration by u substitution. So let's look at this integral. Integrate x times e to the power 5x squared plus 1 dx. Now, in integration, you don't have a product rule. So the only way that you can do is by substitution. So uh, let's do the substitution. So let's say let u is equal to 5x squared plus 1. So what my ultimate goal is to write the whole thing in terms of u. You've got x, you've got dx. Okay, so my goal is to write x dx in terms of uh, u. So that means what I'm going to write, can I write this as same as, this is same as e to the power. This is one skill you will learn by practice. So this is 5x squared plus 1 times x dx. Okay, by practice, you should be able to see x dx in this form. So differentiating both sides, so can you say du by dx is equal to 10x. Okay, and dividing both sides by 10, this implies 1 tenth du uh, is equal to 1 tenth du by dx. Okay, so let me write, let me divide both sides. So I'm going to multiply both sides by one tenth. So this is one tenth du by dx. I'm doing more steps so that you understand is equal to 10, is equal to x, sorry, which implies one tenth du is equal to x dx. Now this is one skill or something that you will learn only by practice. Okay. So what I can do is now in place of x dx, I can put one tenth du. And in place of 5x squared, I can put u. So this whole thing has changed into a u form. So this is integration of e to the power u times 1 tenth du. You can factor the 1 tenth out. So this is 1 tenth integration of e to the power u du. And this is nothing but 1 tenth e to the power u plus c. And now you have to just re back substitute u, which is 5x squared plus 1, so plus c, plus not 10, sorry, plus c, which is the constant of integration, so which is equal to 1 tenth times e to the power 5x squared plus 1 plus c. So this is your answer. This is the integration of this integral. Let's look at one more. 2x times x minus 1 to the power 4. So as a rule of thumb, what is what looks complicated, you should substitute. So I'm going to let uh, x minus 1, or u is equal to x minus 1. Let u is equal to x minus 1. Now I want, my, this is nothing. This is same as writing integration of x minus 1 to the power 4 times 2x dx. So my aim is to write this in terms of u. Okay, so the first thing, let me differentiate this. Okay, before that, okay, so let's differentiate this. So can you say du by dx is equal to 1? du by dx is equal to 1, so you can say du is equal to dx. So in place of du, you can put dx. Okay, so you can't do the whole thing, but you can do dx. Now this implies, can, you, can I multiply 2 to both sides? So can I say 2u is equal to 2x minus 2? My goal is to look at 2x, and this implies 2u plus 2 is equal to 2x. So in place of 2x, I can put 2u plus 2. And in place of dx, I can put du. So this becomes integration of u to the power 4 times u to the power 4 times. Uh, in place of 2x, I can put 2u plus 2. And in place of dx, I can put du. And now this has become a simple polynomial. So this is integration of expanding this out. So this is 2u to the power 5 plus 2u to the power 4 
Am I right? 2u to the power of 5 plus 2u to the power of 4 du. You can factor the 2 out. So this is 2 times integration of u to the power of 5 plus u to the power of 4 du, which is 2 times, this is u to the power of 6 over 6 using integration of polynomial plus u to the power of 5 over 5 plus c, the constant of integration. And now you have to back substitute what is u. So this is 2 times x minus 1 to the power 6 over 6 plus x minus 1 to the power of 5 over 5 plus c, the constant of integration. Okay, and the last is this. Okay, I want you to do this yourself and uh, come up with an answer. Hope you've done this. So uh, I'll do this fast. So I'm going to do substitute this as my u. So let u is equal to 2x plus 5. I'm looking at 2x plus 4 in the numerator. Can you make this 2x plus 4? Well, if you take away 1 from both sides, you can say u minus 1 is equal to 2x plus 4. We're taking away 1 from both sides. Okay, so in place of 2x plus 4, I can write um, u minus 1. And differentiating both sides, or differentiating with respect to x, du by dx is equal to 2, which implies half du, half du is equal to dx. So I'm going to do these three substitution. In place of dx, I can put half du. In place of 2x plus 4, I can put u minus 1. Okay. And in place of 2x plus 5, I can put u. So this changes to integration of uh, this is u minus 1 over square root of u, square root of u times half du. I'm going to factor the 2 out to integration of. I'm going to write this as u to the power 1 minus u over, sorry, minus 1 over u to the power half. u to the power half. Square root of u is same as u to the power half du. So this is half times integration of u to the power 1 over u to the power half you can distribute this minus 1 over u to the power half du which is equal to half times integration of u to the power 1 minus half is half minus u to the power negative half negative half du Okay, we're almost there. So this is, let me change color. This is half times, in integration, you add the power by 1. So this is 3 halves and divide by the same power. And adding 1 to this, this will give you minus u to the power half over half plus c, the constant of integration. So let's simplify this a little. So this is uh, same as writing half times, this is dividing by three halves is same as multiplying by two thirds, two thirds u to the power, three halves, and dividing by half is same as multiplying by two, u to the power half plus c. Now expanding with this two, I will get, this is one third u to the power three halves, uh, half times 2 is 1, so this is u to the power half plus c. And now to just substitute what is u, I know u is 2x plus 5. So final answer is very interesting. So this is your final answer, it's 1 third times 2x plus 5 raised to 3 halves minus 2x plus 5 raised to half plus c which is your final answer. And this would be surely a merit question at NCA level 3 calculus paper.